Okay, howdy. Today's date, it's uh, August 3rd, 2015. I think it's going to be 101 today or 102 today. And each day this week, it's going up here in uh, Dallas, Fort Worth area. It's going to go up at about a degree a day each day all this week. Yes, this is uh, Windows 10. This is the Enterprise version. I, uh, I've i formatted my hard drive and removed the uh, Linux that I had on it and I put this on there. I Everybody's talking about Windows 10 and I wanted to really... I should have... Anyway, I like it. I just put it on yesterday, last night. You can see they fixed their... Uh, menu problem that so many people didn't like Windows 8 I think it was 8.1 or whatever and didn't like Windows 10 the preview versions or whatever I believe it is but uh, they have fixed the menu problem I I like it and it seems to be working really well uh, I, I've over the years purchased a lot of computers. They always came with Windows. Well, of course, the early ones came with DOS and or the TS, you know, Radio Shack, you know, operating system or something, you know. But over all the years, I've bought a lot of. But I've bought very few times have I actually bought, gone out to a store and walked in a store and took the you know Windows software and purchased it. I can't remember ever doing that. So I wanted to upgrade to get the free upgrade to when to uh, uh, Windows 10, and none of the OEM uh, codes that I had, product codes, would be you know were accepted. So you are able to download this for 90 days you can use it for 90 days and uh, that's what I'm going to do and it looks like I'm just going to have to purchase go out and spend a hundred dollars and buy I don't mind spending money for things that you know that I want that you know that I can afford I just hate that millions and millions and millions of people are going to get Windows 10 for free and I'm Gonna to have to go out and spend a hundred dollars to get it, but I guess it's just the way it's just the way the life is, right? Um, I've tried it. This installed without a problem. Um, I installed some things from uh, DVDs that I had. I uh, on Amazon had a photo. Uh, fo photo video studio or whatever it was a, I uh, downloaded that and then installed that and then that updated it and uh, everything seemed to be working I don't care yet for their new browser uh, Microsoft Edge but maybe I'll find but I put Firefox on there on here and I'll be adding uh, probably Chrome and I think Chrome will work really well because uh, Windows 10 here is working very well with applications uh, and a lot of the applications that are on my cell phone I uh, have on here now but uh, Chrome works really well with apps too and I think it'll work even you know, work better. So, um, that's pretty scary, isn't it? The uh, camera program on here is, of course, uh,
using my Logitech C920, which you are all so familiar with. But it's kind of funny that it's not using the Logitech uh, software. It's using uh, Microsoft software to control it. But it looks like it works really well. Uh, this is for taking a still image. And of course, you have some control. And then there's also the video, the video mode. I'm not going to kick into the video mode right now. I think I could kick in just fine. But I don't want to crash right now. It, I haven't had any crashes, but I just, I mean, making this, capturing the screen capture and doing the things that I'm doing take a lot of resources uh, on the computer, and I just don't want to have to do this little video over again. Uh, what else? Uh, the, uh, Oh, what do they call it? No, you don't have to. Uh, you don't have to call it by name. Cancel the 10 a.m. alarm. Sure, I've turned off your 10 a.m. alarm. See what can we ask it to do? Uh, oh, let's. What's the temperature in Fort Worth? It's currently 77 and partly cloudy in Fort Worth. That is, uh, that's really nice. I think a lot of people will, I haven't experimented with everything that you can, but, you know, uh, the ability to set an alarm and, you know, remove the alarm and, and do stuff like that. Uh, I'm going to bring this to a, I just uh, wanted you to know that I'll now be using Windows 10 and I look like the, you may notice no headphones. I had a, I had the Sound Blaster uh, tall speaker that I did the little review on. I had the, and it has speakers in it, and it's USB, actually also Bluetooth, if you want to use it that. It also has uh, speakers, microphones in it. I also had the headset hooked up, which was also USB uh, receive and, you know, transmit. And I was trying to keep track of which, uh, it found everything. But I was, uh, trying to keep track of which microphone was being used and whatever and I just decided to unplug them temporarily uh, so I, I knew which microphone was being used and which camera was being used and everything so I'll probably be adding those back but I think the audio is pretty pretty good using the Logitech C920 but I'll probably bring the headset back I don't like wearing a headset my head is not shaped for hats, not shaped for headphones. So uh, you're going to be hearing a, I guess maybe this today I may plug this thing back in. I haven't, um, haven't had, had any problems with, I installed uh, Steam and Tried to play Civilization 5 and it played. I didn't give it a real test. It seemed to me like it was a little bit slow, you know, to make each move. And I just don't want to play it that way. But that'd be the only, uh, and I'm not sure I got every the settings where they should, you know, where they should be. So I'll be making some videos and I'll be using Corral screen capture. I'll be using Corral. Video Studio X7 and working on images. I'm not sure. I may just go ahead and load GIMP, but I also have Fo uh, Corral Photo Shop. I think it's XA, I think. Can't remember. I may use that, but I don't. I don't mess with images a lot. 
anyway, uh, thanks for watching. I wonder if I could ask Cornelia or whatever it is. No, I better not. I was going to ask her to stop this or shut it down or something. I don't want to lose this file. So thank you very much for watching.